60 matches done. 180 races raced. 1,303 obstacles cleared. Three rounds of action have led to this moment. 16 teams began this game of obstacles. Just four remain. Dial Singh College, Casey College, Madras Christian College and lovely professional university. Only three more matches and nine more races before we will know our Maruti Suzuki Devil Circuit College Frenzy Champions. The winners are going to win a cash bounty of six lakhs. The runners-up will have to satisfy themselves with three. And the fastest contestant in the final gets to drive home the all-new Maruti Suzuki Swift. Circuit College Frenzy. Out of the next few hours, we will be witnessing history in the making. Lots of excitement here at the College Frenzy Arena in New Delhi as our final four teams get ready to put their best foot forward. And the good news, of course, coming out of last week's quarterfinals is that the two hot favourites, if you like, Dial Singh College and Madras Christian College, have been kept apart in the semis. Dial Singh will take on KC College in our first semi and then MCC up against the beautifully named lovely professional university in the second semi. The favourites of course are the Alsing College and Madras Christian College who have clashed once before and what a match that was. Will the decisive battle be between the two fantastic teams or will it be between Casey College and lovely professional university? Before the race begins here are the new play formats and the rules. It's an emulation time now there are no second chances the first head-to-head -head match will have Dial Singh facing off against Casey College. And on the flip side, we'll have the Madras Christian College going up against lovely professional university. There are three members in each team, and each match will have three races where all three contestants of Team 1 race all three contestants of Team 2. And they only have three minutes to finish the course. The team winning two of three or all three races will be declared the match winners and face off for the grand prize. The course is now as tough as they come. The contestants first encounter the ledge walk. Five tricky ledges in an ascending order with the last one dropping to a lower level. Next is the side shuffle where contestants move across two parallel trusses six feet above the ground to reach the camel back. Another parallel bar innovation featuring two curved bars with a challenging decline and incline. If they do reach here, they must maneuver the sea of poles. The obstacle is made up of three sections. A series of poles followed by a series of hand grips and again another series of poles. The slanted wall is the fifth obstacle. It's been flipped on its head so contestants will have to come from the wrong side up and then slide their way down. Followed by the push your limits obstacle which the racers must limber across as fast as possible. The last two obstacles are the angle run of a slippery metal chasm and finally the summit. A lofty 14 feet high curved wall which the competitors must scale to reach the buzzer. There's a lot of excitement as well as apprehensions in the camp today. Coaches, friends and families are all here to support them. And the big winnings is Rupees 9 lakhs as well as swanky new Maruti Suzuki Swift. Which is a great, great opportunity and an achievement for any college kid. If I were in college, I would have definitely given a shot at it. The semi-finalists are at the start lines and first up are the Alsing College against Casey College with the one and only Himanshu Rana facing Vikram Mohanty of Casey College. Himanshu Rana, an unstoppable force and an immovable object from the top of the table. He's the fastest man on the course and he'll be going up against Vikram Mohanty, the talisman of Casey College and a speeding bullet train from Mumbai. He's fast, he's ferocious and he's in. Fine, 
So here we go then, it all comes down to this, the final four. The first semi-final sees the pre-quarter-final favourites, Dial Singh taking on KC College. Himanshu Rana, what a day he's had for Dial Singh. He's on the furthest part of the screen as you look there. And Vikram Maharati for KC College, nearest to us on the left, on the head-on shot. What drama here, Sananda, as both these men give it their all to try and help their college book a final spot with that six lakh prize fund in sight. Absolutely. Now, both these colleges are definitely eyeing for a place in the final. Iman Turana has had quite a day. He's had all the support from his peers as well as from his family who has been present for every match that they've had. Vikramandi also giving his best for Casey College to get into the finals, trying to lap it up. All the glory, all the wigger when it comes to the Haman Shurana already with one of the fastest times you'll ever see on this rejig quarter-final course. The semi-final course is a little bit tougher now, and this will tell you how it is and why. The slanting wall has been turned the other way. You've really got to muscle up to get up and over it now. It's no barrier to Haman Shurana, but of course, if he can get past Push Your Limits, the big drama will come for him when he gets to the, lead the angle run, which was where he committed the cardinal sin in his quarter-final final match that almost cost his college a place in the final. Here he goes, no such mistake this time, surely. Oh, he was very close, but I think he was just okay. Up and over he goes, and Dial Singh are gonna make a winning start in the first seed of semi-final number one. Dial leading Casey by one heat to nil. It's Hamanchu Rana beating Vikram Maharati. Dial Singh almost affirmative has a place in the final. How do you feel about that? I'm very well. Over it, nothing has happened. Team, ne, to deserve karti hai. Ab jagdo jaise kis baat ki rahegi ki car jeetni hai? Yeah, ma'am. Car ke liye, jis din selection hua tha, jab hi soch liya tha man mein car leke ja. What will be the strategy for the future? In Monkey Bar, there was a problem. Actually, I had to go to my team. Against the team player, they were also here. Or they were a little bit further. My idea was that I would skip it, but my hands were also very painful. Then I thought that I would go to one and one. And when I went to one and one, I would reach my hand. Then I gave up and said that I would leave my team members with my team members. They would probably do something else. Then I would give up and give up and give up. And then I would give up and give up and give up and give up. What about that time, Sananda? One minute, 21 seconds. Himanshu Runner of Dar Singh was running like he had a train to catch. <laughs> the big question now, of course, is will his two teammates match that standard or can Casey somehow fight their way back into this semi-final match? We'll find out after this break.